Hi guys, I got myself all ready for the day. Got out of bed before 9 a.m. on a Christmas break, no school day. Got fully ready, did my makeup, straightened my hair. I, I mean, it was straightened, I just fixed it up. And <laughs> we started getting messages that one of our employees is sick today. And that means we cannot do our company party. Because when you only have three employees, and only two of them have spouses. So that means only two of them and one spouse can come to the party because the other two are sick. Kind of makes for a blah kind of party. <laughs> um, so our one employee and her husband have made all the food um, for this party. And the one that got sick, I think she was bringing a salad and maybe a dessert. So that could be put off. So they've decided, um, well, they've pre-made a lot of the food and then we're gonna just warm it up um, in time for the party. So we've decided to tentatively postpone the party until tomorrow night. They all work tomorrow. Um, so I will have to drive up separately and help them set up as soon as they close the store and then we'll have the party tomorrow night. Um, just, it's a little bit harder because then she won't be home, our one employee won't be home with her husband to help him Get the food ready. Maybe we can let her go home We're early. Close the store an hour early so we Are can you? help set up. Let her go home maybe even an hour before that to go help Josh or something. I don't know. We'll figure it we'll out. Figure out how busy it is. She's taking the day off. Oh, she is. So that they can. Okay, yeah, that makes more sense. Home. I'm like, she needs to be. And able then we'll to, like, close an hour early to help start setting okay. up. Okay. Well, so that's the that's the ditty. We're not having. Um, so it means I have to do my hair and makeup again tomorrow. <laughs> Just kidding. I mean, I will. But this is day three hair. It's not gonna last to day four. And I wanted my hair done for um, this party. So, um, we have zero plans for the day. I have to take Chelsea, what time is it now? We have to be back in an hour and a half to take Chelsea to her friend's house. She's arranged to have, um, to hang out with her friend. I'm trying to get Ashley to plan a play date, but it, Seems like a lot of them can't play until later tonight, so maybe she can play tonight? I don't know. Um, and I might get to finishing my wrapping, which would be fantastic. So I'm gonna put the last of my lotion on from this little bottle. I was like, I'm just gonna throw it away. And then we're headed to Costco. I don't think we need very much at all, um, especially because we did a deep dive into our fridge and freezer last week. <laughs> um, but we are getting more pumpkin pie for Abby it is, as my dad would say, her ice cream. My dad always said as a pediatrician, when children are sick, they have a sore throat, they have a fever, they don't wanna eat, and parents kinda panic, um, give them ice cream. They'll always eat ice cream, no matter how they feel, unless they have the flu. They'll always eat ice cream. It's great calories, it's great for sore throats, it's great dairy, give them ice cream for a day or two, not gonna kill them, and Pumpkin pie has been Abby's ice cream. She can eat it now, she can swallow it, um, and she doesn't have to chew it, and it tastes great, with good calories. So we're on our third pumpkin pie. <laughs> we're gonna go get that along with another, a couple other groceries at Costco. Um, yeah, can't get the ice for the Christmas party until tomorrow. We might, well maybe, we might have room in our freezer now. But other than that, just join us. It's a surprise for both of us, what we're gonna do today, because we literally have had the whole day planned out, mapped out for this company party, and now we don't have to do it today. All right, here is our haul. I remember we have one more um, dish pod for the dishwasher, so we've got that. Eggs, um, raspberries, bananas. We're gonna try and see if Abby can like, kind of smash it and then scoop it into her mouth. She cannot bite it. Um, two pumpkin pies. Hopefully the second one gets us to Christmas Eve. We are um, discovering that a lot of our face towels are smelling not so fresh. So we got a huge pack for like 12 bucks. Cucumbers, jelly, soap, um, it was on rebate. Um, graham crackers for you. Yes? Yeah. Ella's gonna come over in a half hour. Okay. We were waiting to see if I could go pick her up. That's why I need you to answer your phone, but it wasn't connecting. Her mom's gonna have her dad bring her over in like a half hour. She's having some lunch. Okay? okay. 
You should too. Have a banana, graham crackers. Yes? Okay. That's what I thought you said. I thought you said yes. I don't know why you don't wear clothes. Eggs. How did you get different eggs? We didn't. And toilet paper. So like, we don't really need very much. What? No, it's not. We got the Charmin toilet paper one time and like the kids are like, oh, we're back to the crappy kind. No pun intended. By the way, we also got a bath mat for Abby and because I destroyed their other one. Speaking of crap, <laughs> Jason's brother is getting his intestines put back together. He's having them rerouted to the correct format, if you will. And Jason's later gonna tell him, it's about time you got your crap together. <laughs> Except he's not gonna use that word. Um, he's going to finally be able to go to the bathroom in full for the first time since April. And he's very excited. So he's in surgery right now, his brother is. And he'll be in the hospital for five days, making sure all of his intestines work and function correctly. So we're wishing him well today. And he is hosting Christmas dinner the day after Christmas. So he, he thinks he's gonna be just fine. He really wants to have everyone over and be grateful for life. And he's really excited to like, just kind Oh, is this not focusing? It's so dark in here. And I just want to show you where, oh, it's bad lighting. I just want to show you where, what, what did it? Here, get back in the car. Get back in the car. No, it's cute. You're just sitting out here eating your, your fries and your $1 Coke. It's fine. I just saw you sitting there and I just made me laugh so I had to get on video that you're just chilling in the car. Just hanging out. It's fine. Just my stuff. It's fine. I'm gonna come home and be all the mom stuff. And so I just like to enjoy my car. You're gonna clean it for me, right? Uh, maybe not the outside, I'll vacuum the inside. I don't want the inside vacuumed. I want the outside looking pretty. It's cold. Even with that spray gun thing, it's cold. You don't have to touch the water. How do you dry it off? It can dry off. I just want no, the dirt off. No, you still got to scrub it. I'll see what I can do. I Time's don't want ticking. the inside vacuum. Abby's car needs to be vacuumed. I'll do hers too. You just take your He's coke. He's lying behind take the your camera. Coke He's and lying. Go back inside. He's lying behind the camera. Okay, we gotta turn it off. Because mm -hmm, you're lying. <laughs> All right, we are home, oh. and I stopped oh. at the post office, and we got two cards. One from Joan. Try and get some better light in front of me. One from Joan. Thank you. I don't have the actual card. Abby has it. But Pam, you should not. I'm not going to disclose how much was on this Target gift card, but oh thank you. Thank you so much. She feels very loved and very seen. I just don't think she understood like the, the vast majority of you who are constantly asking about her thinking of her, wanting to make sure she's okay. I have Ashley and her friend down here. Yep. My favorite Ella, as she says. The only Ella. The only, only Ella, Ella we know. Well, hey Ash, can you hook this card down there? Technically, you have that on there. That's named Ella. Oh, there's Kaylee. She's emerged. There's another creature from the wild. They're not amused by my antics. So thank you for your cards and gift cards to take care of Abby. I do have one more package. I have a feeling I know who it's from, um, but it's at the facility, um, but not available for me to pick up yet. So, hey Ashley, can you come clean up your mess at my desk yet again, please? Thanks. Including that mess down on the floor that somehow is next to the garbage can, but not in the garbage can. Okay, is this you guys' turn? Oh, that's gone. I'll take that. Bye, Kaylee. Are you coming back here? Yeah. Where are you going right now? We're Shopping with money. Okay. Um, oh, Kaylee. Safeway. Kaylee, we saw Max. Safeway is, is Jacob's favorite store. We saw it. Okay. 
Oh yeah, we saw Max the other day. He went nuts over oh, he us. Goes nuts. And then he, yeah. He like, All right. Well, Jason. Oh, excuse me. Jason is actually cleaning his car. We'll see if he actually. I don't need my car vacuumed out. It's going to continue to get. Um, the sneeze never comes. <laughs> so annoying. They don't have soup anymore, and so we're going to a drop-in in case I didn't say that. And they, there's literally nothing on the menu that she could eat. She wanted to, but she's like, there's literally nothing. Hey, Kaylee, we're gonna go. Taking the girls to Red Robin. Are you wanting to go with us? Oh, did Jacob say no and you wanna go? Yeah, Kaylee wants food, that's I want food, that's it. I'll see if there's something I can bring home. They likely won't finish everything. No, I'm not getting Cafe Rio. I'm not even gonna watch the oh, Seahawks game. Oh, I forgot we're not gonna be gone. It starts at five, doesn't it? Oh yeah, you got a bit though. I mean, I gotta record it. Yeah. You're and you got it. Like, there's no nothing, Jacob. You aren't gonna be mean to me. No. I'm no. No. Are we gonna play that game when I get home, though? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll be back in a couple hours. Bye. Hey. What am mine. I doing? They aren't yours. Those positive notes. Oh, they are positive Those notes. Positive notes. Nice. Well, I don't know why it's on my desk then. Cause it fell. I didn't okay. put it there. Well, Thank you. Wow. Didn't put it away oh, either. Um, got out this little nail kit that Abby ready? had gotten. Well, I don't know. I might have little stubby nails. I mean, I might try it. Those are cute. So, just leave them right there. But we're gonna go. Correct, Ash. Yep. And yep. Ella. Yeah. We're gonna go pick up Chelsea, and we're gonna go to Red Robin. Just the girls. We kind of made that plan last minute. Um, dad had already eaten, so he's gonna let us go, just the girls. And Abby can't go because there's nothing that they have they she have can eat. Milkshakes and smoothies. Part of why I agreed to take these girls to Red Robin <laughs> hopefully it doesn't cost me just as much as I would have spent otherwise. But her friend Ella does another type of cheerleading, and they have like open gym night tonight or during the break or whatever. But she doesn't have guest passes, and it's $20 to get in for open night, but you have to have a membership, and the membership fee is $80. So to go for open gym night, to do absolutely nothing with no supervision, I mean there's supervision, but there's no like structured anything, it's $100. And I'm like, no, <laughs> I would rather spend $6 each and take you to Red Robin. And that's it. Like, I'm sorry, I'm picking up Chelsea. She's gonna go with us. Um, and her friend is just so fun. I just, I love it. She's been over here for hours. Anyway, um, this is way cheaper for me to take four or three girls to Red Robin than it would be to take one kid to an open gym. So this was my compromise in order to give them something to, to do tonight. Chelsea gets the front. Seniority always. I'm ranks. older. Yep. I'm How you doing? Good. What did you make tonight? Cookies. Did you get to have one? No. no. You didn't? <laughs> no, they didn't start finish baking. Like she's just pulling them out of the oven. Oh, well, that's okay. Won't you want to wait? No, it's okay. Did it? Okay. And she didn't want to come. She couldn't come. No, she couldn't. Okay. Can she I have something? I'm not fully sure. Can I have my bubble warmer, please? Me too. I want. Do you still have an activity you could go to tonight, kiddo? What day is it? Oh, it's Monday. I, I'm getting my days mixed up already. <laughs> like, oh my! Day. I was like, I was like uh, <laughs> she's cleaning up. <laughs> Go do it again. It's starting to get dirty. <laughs> do it again, Ash. Do it again. Oh, no, Ashley. <laughs> <laughs> no, I do it better. I do it better. <laughs> my my camera is all. <laughs> Well, the balloons were the only evidence that we went to Red Robin, even though we are just exiting. You have a good night? Yeah, I was tired. This is the yeah. evidence. That's the evidence right there. The Two balloons that I can't stand taking home. Mm -hmm. And a little bit of mac and cheese and some fries. Mm -hmm. But Chelsea and I both got salads. <laughs> you got what corn doggies. Or gonna be nothing. I mean, like, this mall is, like, dead. No, yeah. There's, like, oh, wow. nothing in this mall. They could add like really cool shops in here if they just tried harder. I know. 
I know. It's not that far. Just drive. I know. They don't even have Walmart here anymore. <laughs> Walmart is gone. I mean, COVID sure took Where out. Did it did. Go? Okay, gotta get Ella home. She has cheer tonight. So we're gonna get her home. Kaylee has requested ice cream at the store. Are we over here? Nope. Nope. Oh, we're in that hand. Yeah. Okay. All right, we're playing this game yet again, and it might not have been very appropriate. <laughs> we should stop on the last round. It got a little inappropriate, but it was really good. So, I mean, the question was kind of like, you had to be. It had to be inappropriate. I understand. We won't even like show them what we just did. Mine was the best. You have no. No, mine was, but yours was more of inappropriate than mine. That makes it better. But yours is like real. Mine was real. Yes. We, we can't show no. that. <laughs> what did she say? So I know, that's why it was so bad. Yeah.